Hello everybody, this is Imazu, and today I'm going to be talking about my current state, just overall, it's my current state of competitive gameplay. Now, um, if I am not mistaken, I will be, Autumn's Ones will be my first major I played in in all of 2022. 2021 this summer, I had work, and I'm not too sure if I played in Springs or Winters. So... Yeah. So this will be my first major back ever since 2021, if I'm not mistaken. I have a bunch of 2020 emblems, but I don't have any 2022 emblems yet. So that would be like the first one I get in a while. It's kind of it's kind of crazy to think that I have been competing for this long as a Brahala player. So, my goals, I'm not going to tell you like my ins and outs. I am between essentially 1800 and 2050 overall. Like, just a big roller coaster spectrum. So, overall, for three years, um, I've been competing since late 2019. And it's been really like. I, I've always loved competing ever since then, but I've gotten older and stuff. Everybody knows my main pick I'm going to play. Everyone knows I'm going to be running core. Because that's just how I am. I also do have a pocket pick that nobody knows about. Um, my aim is to hopefully get top 128. Um, I do not want to place any lower than 129th, however. So, if I do, well then that's unfortunate. Uh, I guess I'm just have to hit the lab and stuff. But however, this I will actually be like prepping heavy for um, Autumn Championship. I'm also gonna be talking about BCX. Now, it is super unlikely I'm gonna be attending BCX due to the COVID restrictions. And overall, even though I can easily afford a plane ticket to Atlanta, it's not gonna be easy to convince my dad to get me to go there. And I am not, I'm not saying other people don't have to, but I personally, at least as of right now, I don't want to take the vaccine. I wanted to let, I want to let it sit a couple years beforehand and see what happens. Essentially the effect is propagated by the news and stuff, but uh, this might not quit my job to like turn this into a political type thing. This is another voiceover. This is not lively recorded. However, um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, I did not record this live. However, what would be good to know is I actually forgot what I was gonna say mid mid game. Um, so that's unfortunate. I've been working pretty hard to, um, now a win is out of reach, but I'm also taking off work to play in Autumns. Now I could go on Saturday if I want, but my boss said I'm good to take the whole week, weekend off and spend it on myself. I've also, um, recently reunited with one of my friends, and even though, like, his, like, situation is not that great, I'm gonna try to maybe, um, once in a while, when I do make YouTube videos about PUBG, Overwatch, and Pokemon Showdown, I'm gonna maybe try to get him into some of them, because he's really, like, kind, and, like, really good person, and I, like, like his company and shit. And I think you guys will, too. But that is the f potentially the future. Now, um... My future plans as a pro player, even though I'm not a pro, um... My future plans as a pro player, um, I don't have quite any future plans, I'm pretty focused on Autumns though. I however recently turned 17 years old, and before you know it, I'm gonna be an adult out of high school. So um, I'm gonna have to get a job, I also have to do some driving stuff, I'm involved in a lawsuit, I'm in, I'm in all sorts of stuff right now, I'm also in high school too. And even though, as of right now, I have all A's, 
it's gonna be a battle on whether I maintain them or not because um, it's not not good that I'm doing this and I don't recommend other people do this but uh, right now Brawlhalla it, to me is more important than school now it wasn't more important to me than work and that's the reason why I took a competitive break during um, my work season which was this summer which ends in October 10th by the way Columbus Day um, however yeah so Brawlhalla is gonna be my number one I also have been having struggles with some friends recently too however I'm done being someone I'm not and I'm gonna be passionate and I'm passionate in Brawlhalla um, even though they skated a game it's still not perfect it's getting better and I am um, excited to compete and just have fun with this stuff um, something else that makes me happy is Boomy coming back because he came he the only reason why he quit was because he's unsatisfied now that we're actually getting updates that are helpful Boomy came back and I hope that Cody Travis and Faison go back to being a twos team however um if I'm not mistaken I heard that um they have been um Cody does not practice with Faison enough so he wanted to um play with someone else during winter twos so that's why Java and Faison teamed up and Cody and Megdi teamed up and Faison was kind of right because they did place higher than Cody and Megdi. Another thing that's super happy is seeing my um, oh he's not my friend but I fucking love Simba fucking dope ass dude I'm so super happy to see him top 8 and 2's with Lampy proud of Lampy and Simba also my friend Shadow OQ um, and his friend Fakey, they also got a top 8 um, in 2's as well. So they ascended and turned into pro players in the 2's category, which I'm super proud of them for, and I'm super happy for them. Shadow OQ actually used to carry me in 2's a lot. Funny story. Yeah, I also have, um, after this, when I get done editing this, this is today, September 21st, um, which I'm not sure if it's going to be released on September 21st, it's essentially when I could get to it, get to releasing it, because I have all sorts of responsibilities right now, when I get to releasing it, um, I will, what's it called? will release the video hopefully tonight maybe I I'm not sure I also have to do a study guide for science and I also and on Thursday I have math homework and I also have to write a personal narrative that I absolutely procrastinated on until I fucking um, last second <laughs> so um, do not be like me do not procrastinate um, so do not be like me. Do not procrastinate. Now, I'm getting a little bit more comfortable now that I am older. I am getting more comfortable with, like, associating my um, personal life and my um, Brawlhalla life together. Um, as you can see, um, if you are following to my Twitter, which you should absolutely follow my Twitter, at ImazuFGC on Twitter. Um, absolutely follow that. Um, I actually changed my profile picture for my iconic Gengar to a picture of me so however you cannot like quite like see my facial features you cannot like not quite see them so you cannot like quite see what I look like but it's like blurry and shit so if I regret um, later on sharing my face and I want to go back to the Gengar I still can but like this would be a good way to ease myself into um into a face reveal eventually hopefully and I'm still, I still have my own personal problems with my mental health and stuff. I'm not sure if I'm overkilling myself though. I still feel like I could be doing more with my brawl career. And, yeah. Yeah, I've been doing a lot. I also gave my friend $10 today for his birthday. Um. Because now that I work, 
I'm actually able to buy stuff for my friends now and stuff and not like buy gifts which is nice so I, I did not quite buy him a gift but that's the first time I ever bought someone a gift out of my own money that I could recall so today's a good day um, I'm proud of Luna and Pubsy. Oh, another, another shout out I forgot to give. I'm super proud of uh, my, f my friend Snipe Socks and my um, kind of friend Llama. They um, hit top 16 a day. I mean, not today. I did not mean today. During twos last weekend, so I'm super duper proud of them. And I'm happy overall. I also rutted myself, so essentially I fell down to 1700, had like two bad days, but I got my shit together and got back up to 1900, so, um, so I got my shit together and shit, so I'm happy with myself. Um... I'm also um my I'm also um looking for a new headphone set. However, my cousin I want my cousin's pair, so my cousin is gonna send me a link to it. Hopefully, it's not overly expensive, but um I'm gonna purchase those and have like a forever headset essentially that I actually like work instead of the shitty Turtle Beach I have. I already have a nice microphone now, um, my Blue Yeti, so that makes me happy. I also hit 100 followers on Twitter recently, so I'm super thankful for all 102 of you that decided to follow me. Um, I'm super duper thankful. And I also recently hit level 93 of core. And also, I think I boasted it before, but I also hit um, top 1 core global in both peak elo and um, currently elo in ranked worldwide for like one day so I can actually put in my bio former top one core global without like any sort of consequence so that's another good thing so me hitting number one core global in both peak and elo at one point allows me to do that and also just hitting diamond core multiple times on PC also hit allows me to do that and I also hit diamond once on my PS4 too, but that was in twos. Highest I ever hit on PS4 is 1970 as of today. My peak this season is 1930 or 40, somewhere up there. Uh, and I have not been playing on my um, PC a lot. But um, hot, top 128 would be absolute goals. If I hit any more, then I'll be super happy. So. I'm not sure I have much more to say. So, I believe that is the end of the video, if I'm not mistaken. If you like what you saw, please like, comment, share, subscribe, etc. Please follow my Twitter if you haven't, AdamazuFGC. I'm a lot more active on there. And I'm also considering Twitch streaming soon, so I might do that. If you guys like what you saw, feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, etc. Whatever makes you happy. Have a great day. Love y'all.